Hello, and thanks for watching Connie's Crazy World. Today is day seventh of Vlogmas. Do you believe it? December 7th already. So, just wanted to go ahead and do an intro why I had um, my fur coat, my fur shawl on. And we've got some potatoes that I grew from my garden that are starting to get a little soft. So I'm going to go ahead and can those up. My dad peeled them and chopped them up for me. I've had them soaking to get out the starch. So we're going to can those up today. And who knows what else? So I'll see you in a little bit when we go ahead and start canning. All right, so I'm on lunch and I got a few minutes. So my dad, like I said, these potatoes, my dad was going to go, went ahead and clean them up for me. So I'm going to go ahead and start canning those. Got some clean jars over here. Um, also, mom took the turkey caucuses from thanks the turkey caucus from Thanksgiving, and she went ahead and made broth. And I've got five quarts of that going in the canner right now. So I'm gonna start by filling these up. go to an inch of head space so I love using these to make um, breakfast scrambles um, my mom's taken them and she's made potato salad with them a couple times these have been soaking overnight and I did rinse them this morning so should have most of the starch out of them so that's why I'm not going to parboil them In the pressure canner, these will can for 40 minutes. Um, the turkey broth goes for 25. I've got my water boiling over there or in my tea kettle oh, you heard it beep and that's what i'm going to use to pour it on trying to get seven of these done because my pressure canner can hold seven okay six um what else do i have here oh my god uh of a pint and a halfer. These are all potatoes from my garden that I grew in those grow baskets. Get some more going. Can't find my normal green guy, so I'm going to just use this to go ahead and debubble with. Gotta get all those air bubbles out. And you see, if you look at it, it was all the way up to this top here, and now it's down from getting all the air bubbles out. Let me go ahead and use this one as an example. You can see lines right up there. It's 
stabbing all around with plastic, not um, metal. I did it with a metal knife one time. Poked at it so hard I broke the glass. <laughs> you live and learn, you live and learn. So this one wasn't too bad. I got all the air bubbles out and still had quite a bit in there. I'm just gonna finish these up. Oh, I didn't turn my water on. all the way up for the top. I'm going to take my towel, put it in vinegar, because I always use vinegar, and wipe the rim. And then I'm going to take one of my candy lids, put it on top, and I don't see. Wipe the rim. Lid on top. Take one of my rings. That ring doesn't work. Finger tight. We don't want to over tighten it. Don't want to use our wrists and really yank it. I'm going to put them over here to go in the crock pot here in a minute. The crock pot canner. This one's good to go. Did it work? All right, I got all my jars ready. I'm just waiting for this to get to when it's pretty dance. And then we'll be timed for my next steps. All right, so last night we had bean soup for dinner. I've heated it back up. I just don't think we're gonna get it eaten. I don't want it to go to waste. I want to pull it out sometime this winter and not have to cook. So I'm just going to go ahead and um, get a ladle, <coughs> pour it into these because if I'm canning, I might as well just keep on going. The potatoes are going right now. I just put my weight on. They should be... Um, starting to jiggle anytime soon. Okay. There's one. This is kind of a thicker bean soup, so... And if when we open it up, it is a little runny, we might want to just go ahead and open and add a can of the navy beans we did the other day that I need to put away. But it was just such good flavor, great ham flavor. I want to get it preserved because I don't think we're going to eat much more of it this week because we have a lot of leftovers in still from the weekend from other stuff so hey bay leaf I win
my little beans. Time to get out. Since this one here is just a little bit shy, I'm just going to go ahead and add a little water in to bring it up to the right headspace. I'm going to inch headspace. All right, that's three quarts ready to go. I just got to. Take my paper towel, clean them off because this is kind of greasy. It's with ham, so made it with ham hocks. And make sure, little hint, make sure you're checking your jars. This was a tomato um, paste, I mean, tomato marinara. And yes, these are ones that fit rings and lids. All right, so that bean soup's just waiting its turn. I'm gonna go ahead and get this area cleaned up. All right, so it's late. I got all my canning done, so let me turn you around and show you what I finished. Um, so I got three cans of bean soup, um, five jars of turkey broth, seven of the potatoes, um, yeah, so I think that's a good day's work for all that canning, um, which is a good thing. So now I think it's time to go to bed. So thanks for watching Connie's fa fun, favorite crazy world. This is my favorite world, too, because it's my only world. <laughs> and I'll see you next. See you tomorrow for the next Vlogmas. Thanks for like. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and all that jazz. Bye.